152 HP, you guys! By the way, be careful of cars. Not for long! Cool. Oh boy. There will be a let's play. Probably and soon. there's our first one of that happening. If you try to go for a further enemy than usual. Yeah, they they get angry. <laughs> so can you just so how does how how much can you just move around? Uh none. Turns? You can't move around on your turn? Yeah. That's all oh, automated. That's, that's all automatic. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's all automated, him doing that and everything. But yeah, be careful of cars. Depending on the speed they can do anywhere from about... Depending on the car size and everything. Usually about a hundred. <laughs> so yeah, pretty bad. And there's certainly another left, there's a let's play on my list right now. That, uh, also has a thing with watch out for cars. <laughs> on the one hand, you don't usually get just completely, you, you want not going to lose like two thirds of your HP from a car. On the other hand, you're not controlling only one character. <laughs> so, <laughs> it's a lot harder to keep track of. It's clearly Breath of the Wild. How did you know? The cars. I mean, you say that like there's not a motorcycle in the game. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah, but I don't think you need to worry about someone, <laughs> someone running around. <laughs> Just a Boca Blitz just comes barreling down in the, in the Ford F-350. <laughs> oh, it does, we gotta tell ya! You made a promise, now hand it over. Hmm. Camera! Perfectly good camera. Uh, who the hell are you? You gotta talk to this guy. No worry, I'll make sure the shots get to the That makes it sweat, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> been a while. Again, you don't have to do it. It's been school. quite a while. <laughs> I'm just having fun with it, don't worry about it. <gasps> the total clam guy! Grindly suit, red hair, it's gotta be him. He's one of the family, told us to kill and drag back Hero's ladder. Vending machine. Sup? Throw the vending machine on. Oh my god, I killed Mr. Miyashi. Oh, he's down for the cat. Yeah. Oh, Learned some skill. Damn, you're strong. We're gonna remember your face, dick! That's not what you had for voices beforehand. I can tell you love your job. Beforehand. You ought to love being alive more. 
else who's gonna take care of that precious camera? A real fist fight between the Omi Alliance and a Tocho clan loyalist! Oh yeah, these picks are go for a fortune! Thanks, Ichiban. Hey, hold up! Well... Oh, glad I was still as a kid. <laughs> what the hell are you doing, man? Don't bother that guy. It was your fault anyway. Come on, get out of here. Okay! If I see now you said beat the shit out of you! to grab the children's soul. The other guy just <laughs> took off screaming. Yeah, you better run, Kamalov! Kamalov? It's a local mascot they made to improve Kamurocho's image. What the hell is a local mascot? Uh, we're gonna be here all day. Remember the internet? It's big now. Use it. <laughs> Fine. Just tell me what happened to the Well, not pro <laughs> probably not that <laughs> far off. <laughs> you remember the internet? It's a big deal. Time, right? Stop! You gotta know what happened, being a local reporter. Yeah, remember Windows? Uh, yeah. It wasn't who he was. You really want to know why Arakawa did what he did? Because I do have this scoop. I'm not a journalist for nothing. So tell me, when did you get locked up again? 18 years ago. And Arakawa had a son, right? Yeah, a young master. It used to be my job to escort him. I don't know the details, but he was kind of sickly, right? Uh, uh, what do you mean, was? Is he better now? He's dead. What? When? How? Uh, would have been about three years after you went into the slammer. As I recall, his condition got worse. There was nothing they could do. Arakawa was pretty fond of him, or so I assume. It was more than being fond of him. Arakawa's son would have died for his son. Maybe the laws changed his perspective on things. Nothing worse than burying your own kid. Yeah. I can't imagine how that must have felt. But I still don't see how that would make him betray the Tojo clan. You don't. Maybe you can't understand, but once you have a child, the rest of your life is over. The kid becomes your life's purpose, you know? So imagine the grief you'd feel if the kid dies. You just keep existing with your life's purpose pulled out from under you. The parents gotta find another reason, any other reason, to keep living. <sighs> Couple that with the fact that Arakawa is a Yakuza. I think maybe his new reason to live became watching the world burn. He wouldn't. Hey, why don't you give me some info now? You really in trouble with the Omi like those thugs said? Yeah. Then you shouldn't just be strolling around Kamurocho. You still got business here? If not, I'd get out of town. Huh? I promise, Kasuga! There's nothing left for you in Kamurocho! But... I mean, I don't know, dude. I'm just saying the Omi are looking for you. So I'd get out of town if I were you. I'll go home. Home? Yeah, the soap land you were born in? That'd be your home, right? Shangri-La. Hey, you're not going there now, are you? Don't do it. I'm telling you, they'll kill you. Kill me?
My GPS is still a bit stuck on 2001. Well, it's trashed. Never thought I'd outlive Shangri-La. So, is this the last stop on your tour of Kamarocho? <sighs> well, I knew you'd end up here eventually. You again? For real? Unbelievable, isn't it? A neon bright paradise like Kamarocho, and here's this dark, rotting husk. What happened here? Do you know? There was a Tojo clan civil war. Some moron drove a dump truck through the place. Well, no one's come near it ever since. And now, it's a den for lowlifes and thugs. Some real messed up dudes living there now. I see. I guess I never realized just how long 18 years really is. That's not the camera yeah, show you remember. Like, on th uh, 10,000 10, years! Like, See what they built on Nakamichi Street? 10, years what? Do you? The new Kamuro police station. <laughs> Just one more set of prying eyes watching everything in this town. That's because of the 3K plan. Without the Tojo clan throwing their bribes and threats around, the station finally got built. That's why everybody loves our go-getter of a governor. The Kamuro police station is just one of his legacies. <laughs> well, that shit doesn't matter to me anymore. Kasuga, I've been nothing but honest with you. I tried to tell you before, the Tojo clan you know is gone. The Omi Alliance from Kansai invaded and won. They rule this city now. <sighs> so, do you believe me now? Yes. Then we're making good time. Well, you came around faster than I thought. Uh, I knew you were the kind of guy who has to see shit for himself. And everyone else be damned. So, I had to let you walk around Kamarocho until it all clicked for you. <laughs> and you got there quick. What are you doing? Trying to guess everything I do? Making fun of me along the way? Well, I didn't guess everything. I just knew you'd come here. Look, man, once and for all, what the hell do you really want? I want you to help me with my investigation. Huh? Arakawa, your former boss, used the police to crush the Dojo clan. Then he gave Kamurocho to the Omi Alliance on a silver platter. You and I both know you can't buy out the police with just Yakuza pocket change. So my theory... Some of that money went directly to Juro Horinouchi, the police commissioner. The police commissioner? Yeah, and I got a bone to pick with that guy. I'd love to see the son of a bitch fired. Of course, I'm just a driver's ed teacher now, so I don't have a lot of chances to get at him. But is one that chance that I do guy? is if I go through Masumi Arakawa. <laughs> and you figure I can help you get to Arakawa-san. Is that it? Congrats, you solved the puzzle. I thought you'd be game because, come on, aren't you dying to know why he turned traitor? But if you don't agree, why don't you tell me? What are you gonna do now? Hmm? I want to see Arakawa-san. It's all I thought about in prison. I just want to see him, talk to him. Well, your information. 
tonight, Arakawa is bringing some Omi officers to a big meeting of local patriarchs. Really? Not true? Oh, yeah. And we're not talking about a sweet little <sighs> The, the usual of, ya of Yakuza cutscenes. We have he our regular, we have these new cutscene models, but, but, but the pedestrians are the exact the same, <laughs> which is why you sometimes <laughs> just see them run the opposite way. Well, where's that way they don't get in the way of the shot. <laughs> I'm glad you asked. Just imagine these tiny little pellets being thrown at them to tell, make them go the other way. Is that the camera's look? Camera's just no, back, back. We're gonna run our shot. Check out that restaurant over there, Payon Tower. Oh, that's um. Oh, have you been there? It's a pretty classy joint. Expensive as hell, though. No, I haven't gone. It's just... Uh, Harkawa-san once promised to take me there. To eat Peking duck. Wait, I get it! This is Harkawa-san trying to contact me! Huh? Uh, what are you saying? Uh, it can't be a coincidence that the meeting is going down there! At a place that meant something to me and him! Of course it could be a coincidence. Come back down to Earth, kid. There aren't many classy restaurants around here, period. Stands to reason he picked one of the only ones. Screw you. It doesn't even matter. What's important is I can finally talk to him. Okay, first of all, the meeting isn't until tonight. And on top of that, the Omi know you're a Tojo loyalist. If they catch you, then you'll have zero chance of talking to Arakawa. Now, luckily, I have a plan for sneaking in. Unless you wanted to bust through the front door like an idiot. Okay, what kind of plan? That's a surprise I'll save for later. Later? What, we're just gonna wait here till I show up? No, I'm sure you have shit to do, just like me. Let's split up and meet back here tonight. Here, take this with you. What is this? A smartphone. I assume you've seen one before? Nah. How do you use it? Why do they make phones so damn complicated? <laughs> <laughs> ah, good old Ichi. Just make sure to pick up when I call you. Whatever. And check your mail, take pictures, call us taxi, taxi and play Flappy Bird. More smartphone functions will be added as you progress in the story. Like Flappy Bird. <laughs> oh, Flappy Bird so too. We're Flappy Bird's the one hundred percent reward. <laughs> what the hell? Wow. Oh, yeah. And night. <laughs> Wait, his name was Adachi. <laughs> oh yeah, they never did give him his goddamn name, did they? <laughs> Did they? Uh, well, while we're here, who oh, yeah. files? Carson. There we go. <laughs> Koichi Adachi. Adachi, police officer. Oh, very suspicious. <laughs> Look, this is an atlas. They're not doing the same damn thing again. Hey, there's also all these side stuff you can do all around here and everything. <laughs> like all of these. Go batting! Go play Sega games! <laughs> A lot. Go beat up thugs! Guess which one's my favorite. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Cool. It's a lot of people, dude.
Good thing he's weak to punches. Oh, no! Right. No! Nah. Nah. War! I thought you were punklings, not happy happiest. <laughs> Good job, Ray. Ow. Oh, I didn't even see that person there. I stopped seeing the map for a while. Son's not even here. I'm sure this is where we're supposed to meet. You really should just sell that business pronto. Well, Don't be sad. Me. Remember what I said? You deal with business the way you deal with fish and women. Catch, then release. Take pride in the catch, but then set them free. Any sporting fish will tell you that. Really? You want me back at the office? I hope you're joking. Pay you generously to deal with this nonsense. The whole idea behind bringing you on was so that I could enjoy my nights off. Ciao! Wow. Tip. Hey, sorry to bother you when you're busy. What? You seen a burly looking guy in a blue coat around here? A burly looking guy? Sorry, my friend. Myself, I only pay attention to the ladies. Sure, yes. Why don't you simply call this person? Is his phone dead? Oh, that's right. He gave me a smartphone to call him on. Uh, wait. How do you call someone on this thing? Well, There's that's no a lot of names. That's a lot of roles. <laughs> what? Yeah, that's a lot of... I, I looked up the guy and I'm like, oh my god. You know, only 242 actor credits. <laughs> Weasel out of it this time, asshole. Shit, he only found me. Oh. Nico got a new cravat wearing fuck one. What are you gonna do right by us? And who are you, might I ask? You don't remember us? You sold us that shit property. Ah, that Yakuza, weren't you? The one who bought the deed for a most successful girls' bar. Successful, my ass. It barely makes any money. You need to make this right, you shyster. Oh, now that is strange. It certainly had a high profit margin while I was running it. The joint's in the red every month. Girls keep quitting, not enough customers. I can't even pay the electric bill. <laughs> I dare say you'll have to become better at managing a business. What you say? Huh. This was a crap business when you pawned it off on me. You better buy it back now. <laughs> You are a funny guy. Asshole. Do you even realize you're mocking the Omi Alliance? Give it a rest, you jerk. Say what? This guy was about to teach me to use a smartphone. I get you got business with them. Get in line. You get in line! Hey, wait just a second. That ugly red suit and that scruffy-ass hair! Why is there yeah. a in the hair? Remember what Anaki said? How there was a Tojo loyalist around here? to look just like this guy, down to the moppy hair. Sick asshole. Enough about my hair. <laughs> ah, so you're an aggressive type yourself, huh? Something like that. Why don't you stand back, Mr. Nick Ogata? This is about to get ugly. I can see that. Will you be fine handling this by yourself? Hell yeah. And you can repay me in smartphone lessons. Sound good? <laughs> Very good. Quit your yapping, and if things get ugly, you got nobody to thank but your own hair! What the battle was on? What's that for the hair? Oh, got a new one. Got the very much the other one. Is it successful to laugh at him and flee? It's very good to success and cause against the wisdom and dreams. So, pretty much garbage now. <laughs> yeah. Oh, 
Bleeding through his health every turn. Four punches! Yeah! I'm bleeding, yeah! <laughs> that looks painful. So, in all honesty, did you sell them a crappy business or not? I certainly did not. It was raking in millions of yen each month at the time of sale. A wonderful little property. If that's true, why'd you offload it? The riffraff you just beat down <laughs> were insisting on protection money. He's looking at all the pedestrians <laughs> stuck on the car back right there. You were only asking mm -hmm. for a measly hundred thousand a month, man. You wouldn't even make a dent in what you were pulling in. Yes, I recall it being something like that. So you know what I told them? If you think it's so easy, why don't you try running it? And you sold it to him just to make a point? You bet I did. I, I mean, can you believe their arrogance? A measly hundred thou? I have a number of businesses, and yes, they do bring in hundreds of millions of yen per month. But the reason for that is I know the value of money. It's very difficult for a small business to make a hundred thou. Ah, so you wanted them to learn just how much work goes into it. Exactly. And I believe now they have definitely learned. Businesses are like women. You think having one will be so glamorous, but there's some upkeep involved. You need strategy, you need passion, and you need to work your ass off to make her happy. So, are you gonna do what it takes to make that bar successful? Fuck that, I'm done sinking money into that bottomless pit. Fine, I'll buy it back from you, but for half of what you paid me. Fuck you! But fine, take it, I don't care anymore. I don't believe I caught your name. Kasuga. Ichiban Kasuga. Ichiban? That means number one, doesn't it? <laughs> That's a lot to live up to, but you certainly did that tonight. Thanks for your help. Sure thing. And, uh, speaking of help... Yes, you want to learn how to work a smartphone, correct? <laughs> Don't worry, I didn't forget. Let's get to it. Where's your phone? Wow, I actually feel like I can make use of this thing now. Thanks, <laughs> Nick. You're welcome. Mayhaps we should keep in touch. When I meet interesting people, I like to think there's a reason why. We can be pen pals. Ah, uh, if you want. But... I got kind of a history, in case you couldn't tell. I got out of prison today. <laughs> oh, that, that sort of thing doesn't bother me. I've been there well, 5,000 times. No, I was charged with murder. Is that so? Oh my, you are interesting. <laughs> and rather blunt, too. You've got more honesty than sense. But I like that. <laughs> oh yeah? <laughs> You might say Damn, I with this character with in a nutshell, I imagine. Pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> Many of them are caring. And you know, Yakuza being heartwarming and okay. fun. I'm starting to think you're shadier than the guys I knew in prison. <laughs> Bad news for me if that's what a felon thinks. One point for Mr. Number One. Guess so. Well, see you around, Ichiban. You're not gonna just randomly call me or anything, are you? I just might. You'll find me to be a very persistent man. Hey there, Kasuga. Who was that guy? Well, my first pen pal, I guess. Huh? <laughs> hey, what took you so long anyway, man? You're the one who set this whole thing up. Oh, I was hungry, so I went and got a beef ball. I ordered an extra large one, and... Ooh. But it was a struggle. <laughs> Guess I'm getting old. I'm 
when you owe. Well, here I am, about to sneak into a high-level OMI meeting. Yeah. Well, hope you're ready. Yeah, that is pretty much your cue to be like, to be like, don't do stuff in case you need it. I recommend doing so. We'll prepare a bit. Prepare with preparation of preparing and What you should do, convenience stores are good. Cars. Menacing men. Oh, we have some cars. Capitalist Punisher! Convenience stores. Head into them. That's the game lets you in. So yeah, HP, HP stuff. Bubble. MP! Good old MP, but... I probably want to go and, do, and, do, and grab some of these. Grab some of the ones like this. And I'm out of cash. Indeed. There we go. So we're up from being drunk and such. <laughs> Cow attack zero! A popular liquid laundry detergent can be used as a material for weapon crafting. <laughs> mm, yeah. What? That's the thing. You can make some pretty deadly stuff with laundry detergent if you know what you're doing. <laughs> you seem to have experience with this, Joel. Something no, I should know. I just heard of people. Who have experience, who apparently have experience with this. It's talking vaguely about it. I have no idea how to make anything. And yeah. now I'm down to 130 yen. <laughs> so very low on cash now. I got a dollar thirty, it's fine. I'll be fine. Rainbow Mountain! And I have a dime. Perfect. Oh yeah, might as well check the store. That's a lot of mail. <laughs> By the way, it's all tutorial stuff. Gotta get rid of all the notifications. Also, you get all these and everything. Brainwash, take a guess. <laughs> Brainwash is pretty much, you'll, they'll attack anyone. Rage, you already saw. Charm, not attack the charmer. Silence, unable to use skills. Drunk. <laughs> Unpredictable actions. Don't be super low level. So you lose if Costco is not out. Yep. Where, where d during random encounters will result in the loss of half of the money you currently have on you, or boss battles, or story battles where you will where you will be returned to the title screen or retry try the fight for a hefty fine. Mm fight things, hit people into things. Like vehicles. <laughs> Nearby objects, we've already seen status effects. 
chain attacks. Now the party member is nearby, the latter may follow up with a chain attack. Chain attack depends on the bond with your party. Or we'll make friends! Beat the hell out of them! May sideline or obstruct your regular attacks when you try to get past them. Cannot block skills, though. So, so yeah, if you're going regular attacks, usually go for the person who's closest to you. Otherwise, keep going and everything. Must end the damage received. This applies even when auto battle is active. I see. If he's kind, you can't make him mad. Perfect attack. About the same. And that's all of it. You can also have taxi for, for fast travel. How 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 much it is depends on where on how far it is you're going. Okay, so this guy's going Album. Nothing. Nothing. Uh these free. <laughs> what even are these things? You'll find out. And the rest is DLC stuff. Anyway, yeah, I completely forgot that I was going to go heal. So good. Whoa. And fine. Yo. Probably. Anyway, next time. That. Next time. Action. Next time we go with a dot with a dot to go to go and try and see Arakawa. I'm sure this will go well. Indeed.